Uh, this here is our newest addition to Reptile Garden. It's a Chinese banded king cobra. It's a female, name's Queenie. Now, being a king cobra, obviously they only want to eat other snakes. So we we were lucky enough to have tricked this one into eating rodents. So I'm just going to show you guys a little trick that worked for us. Not to say that it's going to work for all king cobras or anything like that. Each one has got its own personality. Oh, not a happy camper. Um, okay. We'll just have a little look at her quickly and then we'll start with feeding. Full of energy this one. Okay, so what we've got here is just two sort of large rat hoppers. You can see we just put a bit of shed around the, the head of the rat. So it's just a shed from one of the, our albino reticulated pythons. So now to see if we can get her to take. Always when filming things, things never quite go to plan, do they? But hopefully we'll get it right. Come on. Oh, there she is. spooked her a little bit there okay, a lot of the time she actually pulls the skin off which is not the end of the world because she actually does come back to it Oopsie. and I have actually had her eating with just wetting some snake skin and dropping the water onto the rodents so eventually i'm pretty sure we can get her just eating plain rodents with no scent of any snake but i mean still even if we had to just put a bit of shed skin on a brat that's not much of a problem a lot easier than finding snakes to feed her okay, obviously she's not gonna like me moving too close to the camera during feeding she does reverse and drag it around a lot and go crazy quite a lot of the time she actually gets stuck on the arms and things like that because obviously they're only used to eating snakes but uh, she gets these down pretty easy so today we're actually going to see if she'll take two of them because it is one of them is quite a nice meal but it barely makes a lump and She's extremely long, so she can handle two of these, I'm pretty sure. She's got an extremely fast metabolism, I've found. This uh, being the first king that I've kept. So we're feeding her every three to four days. I just wanted to fatten her up quite a bit. It's just the lid with the other rat going for a ride there. Okay. Cool, so maybe we'll make another video once she's going to the second one. We'll see how that goes. Cool, so that's just a handy little tip which can be tried. A lot of people get their king cobras on chicken necks and chicken drumsticks. 
normally I don't know if it's mostly the Malaysian kings which take to those foods a lot easier okay this is typical Queenie that's her name she loves to drag the thing around and go crazy but she always does take it down okay she's just finished her first rodent <coughs> so we're gonna see if she wants a second one so also just a little bit of snake shed on the on its head she did struggle with the first one to get it down quite a bit Go. Yeah, this wire hanging in the way is just the temperature probe which I have for it. The heating source I've got is a what's called a heat projector. A very cool heating device. It's got a nice uh, ceramic core wrapped with uh, filament. You can kind of see it glowing red hot there. So that's on a dimmer stat. So it controls the temperature just right. Cool. I'm pretty sure she'll get that one down just fine as well. Thanks for watching.